Hello, beautiful people of knowledge. People learning to expand their wisdom. People learning to love, learn, and grow. How are you doing today? So, as you can see right now, I'm out in nature. Well, sort of. Government actually closed down the hiking trail, which I think honestly is pretty crazy. It's just like they, in a state, in a sense, they want you living in fear right now. That's okay. I still got as close as I could, and I don't think the view is too bad. It's a beautiful day, a little bit cloudy, that's alright. How's your day going? People, I honestly feel like they do want you living in fear a little bit. But you can't let that get to you right now. No, you can't. See, the world is going through a massive shift right now. It's We are just going through massive change. And governments don't like change. They like the stability of the system that they have built. A lot of people did predict though. A lot of people like Bill Gates, a lot of spiritual people, that between 2020 and 2024, we would be going through this rapid acceleration in consciousness and the world would be changing at such a rate we've never seen before. Now we've never seen anything like this before. But it has had to happen. See, what we are going through, as I have said, is evolution of consciousness. Lots of people are tragically going to pass away. And my condolences, if you know somebody that has been affected by this virus, I wish love to their life. I'm super grateful for all the nurses. Shout out all the nurses and first responders that are working off the clock and helping out so many people but right now this is not a coincidence you see we're going through the shift in consciousness and things are never gonna be the same again i think we're starting to realize we're coming back to ourselves and it's a beautiful thing we're coming back to spending time with the family we're coming back to being alone with ourselves the 9 to 5 life of busyness, hecticness, and craziness is no longer anymore. Things have changed. Now this is not going to be over for a while. Till my prediction. Which you may not like to hear. And take it with a grain of sand. But I don't think it's me gone till it has killed millions of people. And when it is gone, I don't think the world's going to be the same again. But see, this is meant to be right now. A lot out of people predicted a little something called the Great Solar Flash. And I am also one who predicted this too. I didn't just predict it, but I saw it happening. I saw it written in the stars that 2020 to 2024, we are going to ascend to 5D. The 5D, the 5D, the 5D, the 5D? Now what is that? 5D is a place of elevated consciousness. You see, throughout our days, most of us live in the third dimension, right? Which is a place of love and hate. This side or that side. Duality, separation. But we are currently going through this evolution process to our higher destiny of fifth dimensional understanding, which is unity. There is no duality. Everything is one. We are starting to understand we must be compassionate for everyone. These are very exciting times, especially since the world used to thrive off things like violence, hates, and wars. Right now, the old paradigm is being vanquished. But governments don't like that, because they held power in 3D. They do not hold power in 5D, as 5D is unity. We elevate our consciousness. We learn how to create sustainable energy. We no longer need government control. But this is where we're happening, what's happening. And in case you've looked around, it's going down in a sense of almost like an apocalyptic nature. This is stuff you literally do see in movies, as this life is a dream and a movie. So be hopeful right now. If you have good karma, including going vegan. It's a huge one for your health and for the well-being of the planet. 
Seven day vegan challenge, just try it. If you have good karma, you will start escalating your consciousness. If you're at this point right now, and you're still tuned in and listening, if you have clicked on this video, you will have probably started going through some kind of awakening, whether it big or small. You're starting to realize that we must be compassionate to Mother Earth. Mother Earth is showing us something huge right now. Are you going to be taking the message? Everything will be alright. We are ascending and transcending the old paradigm. New beginnings always start out with the end of the old. We are ending the old and we are moving into the new. Don't fear these times. You do not have to be who you were yesterday. You can have an evolved mindset, a changed perspective. Now let me think, let me tell you what I believe, what I think, what I see is happening after this. Number one, we are more compassionate to the earth. We realize that this is the only earth we got. This is what sustains us and we don't need to destroy it. We realize we have enough food and enough water to feed the world. So we are a lot more compassionate. There are less wars over stupid things. I really think people are going to unify and help out one another. I think money is not going to mean as much. I still think it's going to be around, but I don't think people are going to dedicate their whole lives towards it. I think people are starting and will be starting to realize what really is important and what really has value is love and happiness in this moment, is growth, and is evolution. So do not fear, 5D is here, and it's coming. Seriously, if you can, get outside, feel the air, feel the wind, love it. I was gonna cross over the line where they tell you not to go, but that involves climbing over something really scary, and I don't wanna do that. You see, they closed it, they closed it on us. And if there wasn't this big drop, I would climb it. So if they caught me doing what I'm not supposed to be doing according to them, and if they caught me going into nature, I'd just say, hey, so last time I checked, you don't own this earth, and no one does. And I'd keep on walking. God would be with me. He's with you. You are him, her. You are light. You are energy, you are love. Do subscribe if you like this. If you want to hear more of these messages of hope, inspiration, and motivation, share this with people as people need to hear this message. I love you. Have a great day. Enjoy. Don't fear the repair.